All right, motherfuckers, are we bringing it back in? Uh, now we're gonna do the rear. It's only Daniel Horacio, Jelly, Stinky around there. He probably ran inside. It's too hot for them outside right now. So we're gonna jump onto the rear. The roto joints on top, they installed already. We have to press in all the little boat, the, the boats that goes around the diff. Uh, we're gonna do the brake kit. Uh, we're not gonna do the center section because I gotta send that shit out when the gear gets here. So I put it on if we're gonna send it back out. And this is all we're gonna install today. We have the rear arms, uh, the coilover lower mounts. All the coilover is gonna get re uh, cleaned up and re-greased. All this shit is a mess. All new hardware for the control arms. When you buy your control arms, make sure you get your hardware new. I just gotta go through all the bolts and nuts, find all the nuts and bolts for all this stuff, the rest of the stuff, like the mount for that. Uh, I'm missing one more there for that. All new washers for that. Mount this motherfucker up. We stop in order? Yeah, the both of them and the the rotor, the little thrust bearings. Clean those up. Mm, and that's it. We're gonna bring it in as we go. It is hot as a motherfucker today, and Horacio is gay. Uh, and that should be it. Uh, we're gonna go get as far as we can on the rear end, cause we're still missing the axle seals. Uh, we don't have the center section. The center section is here, but we don't have the gear for it. Uh, what else? We're gonna put the brakes, uh, we're gonna fully mount them to the differential, but the rest is just gonna be hand tied in just to, to mock things up. Uh, and that's it. We're still missing the inner seals for that. It's already clean and everything. So we bring it in. All right, uh, differentials installed. Uh, these you can lock them up, ready, uh, torque them down. You don't have to put the car weight on it because uh, they roto joints. We're gonna try to show you on camera the flexibility. You see how it's flexing this way? And you see that one, how it's flexing? Uh, if you have regular rubber joints, uh, the diff won't be that fully down. But I shall pick up your corner. So you can see, you see that? Now Danny, you pick up your corner. Oh uh, yeah, some weak asses. Go, I shall pick up your corner too. Danny, pick up your corner too, doubles. See that? Beautiful. See the flex on it? Okay, uh, Rasha, put on, put down your corner. See that? All right, Danny, your corner. These are great for low riders too. I don't, you gotta make them really strong on the centers, on these centers things. You gotta make them like box or some shit. But if you can put those joints on low riders, you won't have no fucking bind on your diff. All right, bringing it back on. Everything is locked tight. Lock, uh, fucking torqued, not locked tight, torqued. Uh, coilovers are in, coilovers are in. Sway bar is in too. Uh, sway bar only the first links are loose, the, the adjustment links are loose, so uh, until the car is fully weight on it, we're gonna adjust those. Uh, what else? That's it. Uh, we're gonna start on the brake kit. I have to press in the the fucking uh, the shit that holds up the fucking uh, the center carrier. But everything is locked in, locked tight, uh, torqued. Everything is done. Uh, This is the kit I use for the right there. That's the one I use for the for the center section. And these are the fucking wheel studs for the rear. This is uh the 12 1.5s because sometimes I use the half 20s, but the that. Diff the the diff like it was already pre-made. 
uh, it was already drilled for 1.5s, the 12 1.5s, so I cannot use the 12s, the 20s, the half 20s. So I had to use this one, but the front, it has a, the front has a half 20s. And the rear is going to have a fucking GM, uh, the fucking 12, 12 1.5s. So right now I'm going to press these and move on to those and start the brake kit. So I'll bring it back. Oh, it was not even. All right, bringing it back. Uh, there you go, your 14 inch rear rotor with a four piston rear. I think they, they call these the arrows, the caliper. They call it the arrow because of the design of it. It looked like, you know, it looked like the front six piston, but it's a four piston, big, big bore. And it's a 14 inch rotor for the rear. Uh, it, it gave us a lot of shit because uh, these are hardened axles and we had to drill an axis hole to get to the backing plate. And it has a parking brake, so it gave us some shit. Uh, you can see the right there's the access hole that we drilled, but uh, I ran out of bit. Uh, we use all these multiple bits just to cut into it. We use all these multiple bits just to cut the access hole, and it's still not enough. It's still not enough because it's a it's a 916's uh 916's a uh, uh, nut. And this is a uh, shit. So it's super thick to go through it. So it's not enough. I, I did it uh, right now. It's, everything is super loose. I use my hands to get in there just to dig, to take the pictures and the video of it. <sighs> just so we can get a final. Um, so I can close this video down. I just got to order the right uh, fucking bit. Or I'm going to have to take them to a machine shop so they can cut those shits open correctly. I'm going to show you on this side, on the opposite side. See, on this opposite side, see how there's no access hole in it? And this plaque goes like that. So there's no way of me getting in there with a socket or a ratchet or anything in there. So you have to have an access hole. They didn't order these axles with access holes. I don't know why. It's just a click. You click it, and it's it. It's not. It's no charge for you to have an access hole in, on the axle. These are hardened axles, so I'm fighting. You know, I'm fighting. It's it's dull in drill bits because it's a hardened axle. So I'm gonna close the video here. Uh, the rear is almost done. As you can see, we pressed in the the bolts. Uh, we're just waiting for the center section, but we're waiting for the gear. The center section is here. It's just the gear. Other than that, it's a roller again. We're just waiting for uh, fucking lug nuts so we can put the fucking gunny wheels back on. The rear, we're going to... Uh, we can put the, the, the wheels back on because I have uh, regular lug nuts. And then yeah, I remember my Escalade. That's what's left over the Escalade. It's just a frame. I have put it this with that. Just put it on top. We're just rolling it back there. That's it. And that's what we got left over the Escalade. Mm, that's it. So I'll bring it uh, next Sunday. I'll bring it back next Sunday. Uh, next Sunday, let's see what we have that gets here on the order so we can finish it. We're going to see if, uh, about that drilling the fucking hole. If not, I'm going to drill, uh, buy the right drill bit, but I don't think it's going to fit my gun, the fucking drill. So we're going to see about that. If not, I just go buy me some new cones new uh, fucking step bits and see so i'll uh, bring it back next sunday